Hello there. The early hours of this morning storm Ellen crossed the Republic of Ireland. At its peak, she brought with it gusts of winds in excess of 80 miles an hour. Now, low pressure is going to control the weather story over the next few days, and that means that we keep this unseasonably windy weather with a case of sunny spells and scattered showers. So low pressure is drifting its way up into the northwest, circulating around that low. We've got uh, shower clouds moving in. That means there's the risk this afternoon out to the west of some sharp thundery downpours into Northern Ireland. Western fringes of Scotland, Wales and England with gusts of winds in excess of 50 miles an hour continuing maybe more on exposed coast. But come further inland with some sunshine in comparison to yesterday, it'd be a better afternoon. Temperatures peaking perhaps low to mid 20s. Now, as we go through the night, that low pressure is going to continue to drift its way steadily east with a combination of high spring tides, gusts of winds in excess of 50, 60 miles an hour. There could be the possibility of some localised coastal flooding, particularly down into the southwest. It'll be a mild start to our Friday morning, mid teens quite widely, and as we go into tomorrow, the winds will strengthen for many of us. In fact, we see that low pressure crossing. It'll bring bands of showery rain drifting its way steadily northwards. And on Friday is likely to be the day where we're going to see widely the windiest weather. And in fact, we'll see gusts of winds in excess of 30 to 40 miles an hour into Scotland and Northern Ireland, but stronger winds for England and Wales, widely 40 to 50, maybe as much as 60 miles an hour plus on those exposed coasts. So sunny spells and scattered showers. Not everybody will see the showers and if you catch some sunshine, it'll still potentially feel relatively pleasant out there with temperatures again into the mid 20s. Now the low pressure is going to drift off into Scandinavia and allow those isobars to open up just a touch on Saturday. So perhaps not quite as windy, still a notable gusty wind out there and there will be some showers or longer spells of rain, particularly the further north and west you are. So it's going to be a windy afternoon, but if you dodge the showers and you see a little more shelter, well those temperatures are still likely to peak into the low 20s and we're losing that humidity. So actually for many of us, it'll feel a little more pleasant. Take care.